Hello guys, welcome to another video. So in this video, we are going to discuss about depth first search algorithm in artificial intelligence with examples. Stay tuned. You are watching the AI and DS channel. Depth for search is a non-informed search algorithm used for traversing or searching a tree or graph data structures. The algorithm starts at the root node and explores the deepest node as far as possible before backtracking and continuing to search for the goal state. DFS uses a LIFO stack that is, the most recently generated node is chosen for expansion. A disadvantage of DFS is that if the solution is found, it may not be the most optimal or the shortest path. A word in search problems In simple language, a search problem consists of a graph with nodes and our goal is to find a path from the starting node to the goal node using the search algorithm, which in this case is depth for search. Fringe is a data structure used to store all the possible states. We will now be looking at different examples of depth for search algorithm. For a search problem, we take into account the following conditions. We expand the nodes which have a higher alphabetical priority and we don't expand the node which we have already visited. Let us now look at the following graph. S is the root node of the starting node, S is at level 0. We visit S, is S the goal node? No, we expand S. This gives A and H. To choose the next node to expand, we choose the one which has a higher alphabetical priority, so we choose A. We visit A, is A the goal node? No. So we expand A to get B and C. We visit B, is B the goal node? No. So we expand B to get D and E. We choose D. We visit D. Is D the goal node? No. So we expand D. When we expand D, we find that D is a leaf node. So we backtrack to the previous node to go to the next node which is E. We visit E. Is E the goal node? No. So we expand E. But again, E is a leaf node. So we backtrack again back to E to explore the next node which is available that is C. We visit C. Is C the goal node? No. So we expand C to get G. We visit G. Is G the goal node? Yes. So it expands G and then stops the search. This is because for the search algorithm to understand that G is the goal node, it needs to expand G. That is why it expands G and then stops the search. Now we'll look at a second example. For this example, the graph can also be represented as a tree. Here S is the starting node and G is the goal state and all the other conditions are as per our previous example. So let's start. We visit S. Is S the goal node? No. So we expand S to get A and D. We take the node with the higher alphabetical priority. We visit A. Is A the goal node? No. So we expand A to get B. We visit B. Is B the goal node? No. So we expand B to get C and G. We visit C. Is C the goal node? No. So we expand C to get G. We visit G. Is G the goal node? Yes. So it expands G and then stops the search. Here we can see that the DFS algorithm does not return the optimal path. Now let us look at another example. For this example, the starting node is A and the goal node is G. We visit node A. Is A the goal node? No. So we expand A to get B, E and D. We proceed to B. We visit node B. Is B the goal node? No. So we expand B to get C and E. A is connected to B, but we are not considering the nodes that have already been expanded. This is because if we consider A, it stays in a loop and it will fail to find a result. We visit node C. Is C the goal node? No. So we expand C to get E, F and G. We visit E. Is E the goal node? No. So we expand E to get D and F. We visit node D. Is D the goal node? No. So we expand D. When we expand D, we find that there is no unexplored nodes. So we backtrack back to E and proceed to the next available node that is F. We visit F. Is F the goal node? No. So we expand F to get to G. We visit node G. Is G the goal node? Yes. So we expand G and then the search algorithm stops. Hope you got an idea about depth for search algorithms. Well, that concludes this video. 
Hope you like this. Please leave a like and make sure to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.